Good afternoon, everyone. I'm going to be doing a uh, inbox, unboxing on the Canon T5i. Uh, I recently just purchased this, and uh, I've actually had the T3i, and I liked it. And for some reason, I got rid of it and bought the T5i, uh, and it actually came in today. So I'm going to be doing an unboxing on it using the handy dandy Leatherman Wave. And of course, the good bubble wrap stuff. My kids actually love that to play with it. Mm, there it is. And of course, the receipt where I bought it. Let's see here. The box says mm, Contents Digital Camera EOS Rebel T5i, Zoom Lens. EFS 1855mm, F3, wide strap, battery charger for the uh, uh, LP8 battery, and a battery pack for the LP, or that's the LP8, E8, interface cable and software, or CD-ROM. Uh, this is actually the kit that came with the EFS 1855 ISSTM. Uh, the T3i, I actually used the kit lids with it, and it actually worked pretty good. It took really, really, really good pictures. So I can only imagine what this one does. Uh, so let's tear into this thing. As you can tell right there, it does full HD 1080p, just like the T3i that I had. Okay, yep, of course, all kinds of paperwork. Uh, warranty card, one of the most important things. Uh, it also tells you something about registering it, uh, expanding your photogra photographic knowledge, uh, Digital Learning Center. And that's for your warranty right there. Uh, disc for SS Solution Disc uh, for Mac and for Windows. Uh, tells you a few of the software that's on here. Digital Photo Professional 3. 3.13 image browser EOS utility photo stitch picture style editor EOS sample music and of course the big thick uh, manuals uh, one of them I believe is English and the other one's maybe Spanish or something I don't remember seems like it seems like it's there for two different yes uh, English one here and Spanish one here Let's see here. Strap. Mm. Pretty wide strap as well. It's like nylon or something on this side and maybe leather on this side. That ought to be like really, really, really comfortable to wear. This is, I'm guessing, the power cord for the charger. Yep, that's exactly what it is. Right there. And plug for USA. And let's see what other. Oh, that's the lens. Uh, bubble wrap. And the kit lens. We'll take that out. That's what that looks like. The other end. 1835 millimeter image stabilizer, macro. You can see all of that stuff there. Okay. Set that over there. This is the charger. Yes, that's where the, the plug goes into. There's the charger. Um, it's got a light here. It says uh, one light's for charging and the other light, I'm guessing, turns green when it is full. That's the way the T3i was. Set it over there. And the battery, which is right there. 
That is the LPE8 battery. And I'm guessing that's the cover that comes on it. That, there we go, right there. Put that on, put that back on there for now. And I'm, I'm thinking this is the inter, uh, interface cable where you actually hook it to your PC. Right there. And it looks like that, I believe that right there is called a micro USB end. And of course, if you've ever had like an old Razer cell phone or something like that, you've probably got plenty of these laying around. And the fun part. We'll look in this box. I believe that's it. Yes, that's it, other than the cardboard inserts. I'll close that back up. If I can figure out how it goes. Which is like that, and that, and that. There we go. Set that back out of the way. And more bubble wrap. I've actually got this right here wrapped up pretty good, actually. Um, it was in that bubble wrap and then in this, I'm not sure, what some kind of paper looking stuff. And there's the T5i. It uh, feels great, actually. You know, it's got this, the the pull-out um, pull screen, and I believe it rotates. Yes, it does rotate. And I always try to use it, take it like that, and put it back in with the screen facing out. It seems a little bit more handy, unless you're doing, like, videos or something. Then it's you can do it like this and, and actually see what you're actually videoing or taking a video of. So there's that. That's pretty much it on that. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and get this paper out of the way and show you something else that I actually bought um, to go along with it. It's this um, deluxe power grip. It's made by Vivitar. And what it does, it is a battery grip for, this, for the T5i, the T4i, T3i, and I believe the T2i. Um, and well, actually that's what it says right there. T2i, T3i, T4i, T5i. Um, the reason I bought this and not the, the original Canon, uh, of course the Canon version is, um, what, 120 bucks. This was like 35 on Amazon. Um, I put a link to it in the description. I read the reviews on this, and uh, from what I can tell, it's got really, really, really good reviews. And um, I mean, it's you know, for 35 bucks, uh, it it actually you can actually use this with two of the LPE8 batteries that actually come from Canon, or you know, the aftermarket like they sell on Amazon. Um, you can actually use two of these, or you can actually use six double a batteries which actually comes in handy because you know you've always got you've always got double a batteries around sitting around somewhere so you know you've it's one way or the other you're going to have batteries uh you buy you go to walmart or somewhere and buy a big pack of batteries the double a batteries and carry them with you keep them in your vehicle even better keep them in your uh, camera case and you've always got batteries even if the even if the uh LPE8s, the original uh, batteries go down. You've all, you can always use AA batteries. You can find those anywhere, where you have to order these online or a camera shop or or something like that, or maybe Best Buy or something. So I'm actually uh, going to go ahead and open this as well. Uh, I was going to make a separate video, but it's not a lot to it, so I figured I would just go ahead and open it uh, with the camera because it does go with it. So I figured I'd go ahead and open it and uh, see what it's like. Uh, I'm not sure what this is. Oh, that's where I bought it off Amazon. It's a thank you letter there. Uh, microfiber. 
clo uh, cloth for cleaning. That actually comes in handy. Uh, instruction manual, as you can see there. And this is your extra cartridge for your batteries. This is the one for the double A's. Right there. That's your one for the double A's. Uh, it says it takes six. Oh, yes, it does. Two, 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 four, six. And I'm guessing the one for the uh, for the, the original batteries is in actually in it, I guess. And there it is. That actually looks identical to the, I mean, as far as the feel and as far as the rubber, the rubber part of the battery grip, it actually feels identical. Well, no, it feels like a little bit softer, a little bit softer rubber than the than the uh, actual camera. Um, actually, I guess we could actually see how it fits. Let's see here. I, th I think you have to take the battery door off, I believe. I believe you do. Yes, you do. And that's really simple. It's actually really, really simple. It goes in like this, like that. And then like that. I mean, it's really, really simple. So you just pull on it at one end and pull out on the other end. So you remove that, put it in like that, and take the cover off of this. And I'm guessing it goes in just like so. And then once you get it up to the uh, screw in part at the bottom, you just actually take it and try to figure out how to do it. You turn this right here and push it up as you're screwing and it's tightening itself down. Like so. There we go. That actually makes, that actually looks big and it's, it seems like it's a lot easier to hold that way. Um, I guess we could take this cartridge out if I can figure out how to take it out. Like that. Oh, okay. Pretty simple. You take this right here, turn it like that, and that back up. And if you want to take it back out, you pull this little clip right here out and turn it counterclockwise and pull it out. Now there's the one for the two um, stock batteries or, or the LPE8 batteries. That's the one that, that was actually already in it. We'll put that back right there. I actually like that. And as far as looking at it, it doesn't look any different. I mean, as far as the feel and, and the way it feels like, as far as the rubber part versus the rubber part on the grip, it actually actually feels real close and it looks real, real similar. Uh, from five feet, away, five feet away, you never would even tell the difference. So let's actually, I guess we could actually take and put the lens on, set that down. And look for the white dot, take that off, take the white dot and do just like so. And it's on. And there's your lens. And I may just do some this weekend and get out and take some videos. And that's, that's actually really, really comfortable as far as like holding with a battery grip on it. Um, it's really, really, really comfortable. Uh, and it's actually got a shutter button right there. You know, the one for the cameras right there. And it's actually got this one if you want to do side shots or whatever. And, I mean, that's that's actually neat. Okay, guys. Uh, thanks for watching my video. Uh, that's it for the unboxing. I, will, uh, I have a couple more things to unbox. So, I will get those videos started and get them done. And uh, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and don't forget to like my videos and uh, look for more videos in the future and have a good day and thanks for watching.